welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a kind of unboxing of the bag that I got from Can. I have a separate video when I got the bag even though I didn't film the actual purchase because I was so in shock but still I have the like after reaction and stuff like that so if you want to see that go check that video out. But now I'm going to be showing you what bag I got in. So I was uh, visiting Monaco and then I went to Cannes for a day and I wasn't planning on buying anything specific. I was just scrolling through the shops and then every time I go to a Louis Vuitton store I usually ask for the pocket Matisse bag just because it's so wanted and I've been looking for the uh, monogram print for at least two years I think and it's always been sold out and yeah well I always ask for it even though I haven't really saved up money for it or anything like that because I never really thought they would actually have it but when I went to Cannes they have it had it and I was so surprised and the person selling the bag was also or the personnel there was also very surprised because I was like, yeah, do you have the Paquette Matisse in the monogram? And then he was like, yeah, I don't think so, but let me check. And then he looked from the computer and he was like, ah, oh, we actually do have it. So yeah, then I got really shocked because yeah, I didn't expect them to have it and I wasn't really prepared. And yeah, and I couldn't really leave the store without the bag, so now I have the bag and I'm super happy about it, but I'm in trouble. <laughs> so I got it in the Louis Vuitton bag. It's kind of torn just because yeah, I had it at the airport and my cat played with it and everything like that. So yeah, it's not in the best shape. But so they gave me an envelope with the uh, receipt and everything like that. So that comes in this orange envelope. And then I didn't get a box with it. I think I should have asked for it if I wanted a box because yeah, they knew that it was coming for me so it wasn't a present even though this is kind of my birthday present because I'm turning 25 in a few weeks. So yeah, but it comes in this dust bag and voila, here it is. I'm super in love with this bag even though I'm not a fan of brown and initially when I looked at this bag because I really like the shape and the model, uh, I wanted a all black one but then when I saw the all black one I thought it was kind of boring and yeah I already have a black bag and yeah, even though this looks like a pretty big bag, it's not that of a big bag. So I have the uh, Gucci Soho bag, so that's pretty big and it holds a lot of stuff. So yeah, then I decided that I really want this monogram print. And yeah, and then I realized that you couldn't get it anywhere and I had to wait for two years until now that I got it because Every time when I looked from like resale values for these, they go for 2,000 euros and I really didn't want to pay that much for this bag because this bag from the store was uh, I think 1,390 euros, so around 1,400 euros, which is pretty expensive for a bag or this is my most expensive bag. But yeah, I really like it and it's simple and it has three compartments, you can see them from here and these do stretch so if you have a lot of stuff in it, it it holds pretty much stuff and then at the back it has this separate zipped compartment and yeah the leather here is pretty light and it has the Louis Vuitton imprinted here and Maybe at some point I want, want to get like a silk scarf or something to cover this because this might get dirty pretty easily, but I have to see about that. And then also some light brown details here and the opening is when you push these two together and then it opens the flap. Then it comes with a longer strap so you can have it crossbody and this attaches to the sides. Like. 
and it also you can uh, assemble it here so you can have it longer or shorter and it has this um, buckle here that you can move so it doesn't flap everywhere which is really nice so yeah and then the inside it has these two two bigger compartments in the middle and then this a bit smaller one but this also it has when you stretch it out it has pretty much space so it yeah but I try to fit my well my, the iPad fits just with to the with like the normal iPad but then I tried my calendar and that didn't really fit and it does fit my Balenciaga uh, bag that I have it's like the square one I can't remember the name of it but yeah so it doesn't fit that many big things but if you have like it would fit a small camera and wallet and everything like that so yeah you can fit still a quite a lot of stuff in here but if you want I can do like what's in my bag video where I show how many things fit in it if that would be something that you want to see but yeah that's pretty much it for this bag and I'm super happy that I got it because I've been waiting for this for so long and even though I'm not a fan of brown but it still is a color that goes with pretty much everything and this is you can even either dress this like with really comfy or then you can dress it up I don't think it's like an evening bag but still you can wear it to like a dinner party or something like that so yeah thank you guys for watching hope you enjoyed this video give a thumbs up if you did and also subscribe I'll see you next time Bye.